Hello everyone and welcome back to our Road to Indian Glory career mode guys Episode number 17 of the series with Bihar Where today we are here back again with more Cricket Captain 2021 action Where today we are taking on Madhya Pradesh in this one day trophy match We are here for match number 3 of the series so far Or at least of this competition so far We are in the one day trophy We have played two games and we've won them both and the only change we are making today is Kumar Rijnish is going to be sitting on the bench. And he got 22 and 14 in the first match, which on the first two matches, which an average 18, it wasn't the best. It wasn't the worst I've ever seen. But with Bashukanath Mishra coming in, he scored 145 in the other one day, in the second 11 one day stuff. And with that, he's got a very good record behind him. I wouldn't say a lot of experience at the professional level, but at the second XI level, I think he has quite a bit of experience. Age 29, played for a while now, and I feel like now is the right time to bring him in to partner up with Captain Kumar at the top of the order. Otherwise, we are making no changes to the lineup. And we are winning right now. We are two from two. So too many changes would not be necessary at the moment. And with that, we are going to jump straight into today's match against Madhya Pradesh at Indoor. Here we go, playing the match. And we can see that Venkatesh Iyer is batting at number four. And he is one of their best players, actually averaging 42 with the bat across his career in a one-day format. Very good. But the current year, only averaging 15. Rohira averaging 53 and Gaud averaging 62. So, and Dubé is averaging 42 as well. So pretty decent figures across their team, actually, despite the fact that they are sixth and we are in third. Mishra is going to make is going to be making his one-day debut today for Biha. Let us see how he performs today. We're going to call heads as we always do. And we've won the toss today. Where is average? Bounce is perfect. The temptation is to bat. I'd say let's have a bat first. Let's let's back our batters. Let's go and have a bat first. I'm normally a bowl first kind of person, but I think this wicket is good enough for us to walk out and have a bat. Galrav Yadav will open up. Then straight away, Carnivore with some spin. See how we go. Yadav to Mishra on his one day debut. And he's knocked over. Would you believe it? He's gone for two off eight. And now that move to bring him in has definitely been questionable. That's for sure. Seven for one for Bihar. And the player of the match, Lamba, the youngster. Kaiba Lamba walks to the crease. Early doors. Has a lot of work ahead of him. Yardov has the figures. Three overs, one maiden, one for four. And it's just another single off the over. We've started very, very cautiously. Yardov comes around the wicket to Captain Kumar. Inside out. What a shot that is through extra cover. And that ends the fielding restrictions. We have definitely been watchful. 25 for one after 11 overs. Not your normal sort of score after 10 overs. But Lamba through mid wicket on the charge. That's four. Dutty. Oh, what a shot from Lamba though. Straight past mid off. Four more. Can't award to Kumar again. 35 for one. Dabbed away. Beats point for four. Dutty to Lamba now. 44 for one. Oh, he's got him. He's got the key player. The number three has to go. He's a big player for us. Goes for 25. We are in all sorts of strife. It has to be said. Look at this field for Kartik. Wow. It's like a test match field. For real. Kartik now facing up to Dutty. Great straight drive off the back foot for four. It's 50 up for the team for Bihar. It's outside the line. Carnivore to Kartik. He's bowled right through the innings so far. Oh, what a shot off the back foot. Through extra cover. And it will just about skip over the rope for four. Dutty to Captain Kumar. He's survived the carnage so far. Moves to 20 or 45. Carnivore to Kumar. Who comes around the wicket as Carnivore. Oh, my. That's just a great shot. Backed away. Went with the spin. Went for four. And again with the spin. Pass slip for four more. Katakia. Off the back foot from Kumar. Four. What a shot. Katakia to Kartik. Dabbed away. Four more. Getting a move on now. 4.3 is the run rate per over. That's a good over though. Another good over. Now the run rate's starting to drop again. Dati to Kartik. Oh, beaten. Nearly seemed back to leg stump, but it didn't. Down the ground from Kartik. That will be four. No one's catching up with that. Dutty to Kartik. 97 for two. 
And he's feathered that one too. That is not good news. He goes for 31 of 33. Ramatula to the batting crease now. 100 for three. Great shot from Captain Kumar. That's a six. Wow, what a shot over cover. First six of the day. 100 up at the halfway mark. Ramatula. We know how he can strike the ball, so he's just got to get himself in. Oy. Oh, no. No. Another terrific catch in this game. And Ramatula has to go. Katakia just chipped up in the air from Ramatula. What a one-handed effort. Gowled with the catch. Sarek Martin to the crease now. 110 for four for Bihar. Not looking good. All on Captain Kumar at the moment. That's four. That is 50 up though. His eighth in his one-day career. Being exceptional for Bihar. Look at that. 57.37 is his one-day batting average. Katakia to Martin. Swept away. Fine. For four. Dati. Nearly bowled out his spell. Last ball of his ninth. Gets Martin. Was that hitting the stumps? I think it was. He plays all around it. Oh, dear. Goes for another low score. And his batting just clipping. And it's turning to be a bit of a nightmare for Bihar at the moment. Dubé to the bowling crease. He's played for India before, I believe. That's a... Oh, my Lord. What a shot over point for six. Anderson has a lot of work to do. Oh, great cut shot for four. Need plenty more of that. 135 for five. Pulled away from Anderson. That will be four. There's a plenty of time left in this game yet. Dutty into his final. He's got three wickets. And he gets a fourth. Kumar, the key wicket. He just edges this behind. Nonchalant as you like. Oh, no. Wow, we have really, really been poor today. It has to be said. We've really let ourselves down with the bat. 142 for six now. Anderson has a whole lot of work to do as he's the only one left that can hold the bat. 150 up, though, for Bihar. If we can scrape 200, it might be all right, but that's not going to help. Aman has to go for two off five. Played all around it. Data to the crease. 151 for seven. And he's gone first ball. Brings Yadav to the crease. And Corey Anderson's really got to retain the strike now. Dubé to Anderson. Edged over the slips. A long way. It's, well, it should have been a six, I think. But it's going to be called four. 155 for eight. Great shot from Anderson. That's going to be four. Katakia to Anderson. Just has to keep making sure he's on strike is the main thing. So Yadav will indeed face up to Dubé. And he's gone for a duck. Oh my goodness me. What is the tail up to? Corey Anderson's got nothing to lose now. 160 for 9 for Bihar. And he's gone for 26. I mean, this has just been so poor. And again, probably shows why I should not bat first. Four for Dutty. Four for Katakia. And, well, I mean, that is just... That's yuck. Really. Really. I mean, we had two batters get 90 of our runs. I mean, that's just really bad. I don't know how we're going to defend 161. Good luck to us. Here we go. Data to Gaud. Gonna need some wickets and gonna need them fast. That's four. Hadadar. That's four. Free hit. That does not help. Through point for four. Hadadar. Off the back foot. Four more. Data to Gaud. Oh my goodness me. What are we up to? Sarek Martin into power play. And that is the end of the fielding restrictions. And I think this game is going to be a short one. Not a whole lot happening right now. Short leg in play because at this point, why not? Aman to Padadar. That is through mid wicket for four. Anderson into the attack. And that's four. It's not going our way whatsoever at the moment. Don't really know who to call upon. Quadri and Aman bowling side by side. We need something here because at the moment they are cruising home. Oh my goodness. Pass point. Four more. We might not take a wicket today. Aman to Padadar. Yep, swept fine for four. I cannot believe sixth place is about to beat us. Really shocking. Magia, 88 without a loss. And not a single wicket. Quadri, he has to make something happen, surely. That's 50, I think. Yep, for Padadar. Sarek Martin, we need something happening here because at the moment, nothing is happening. 2.2 per over needed. I mean, anyone would in their right mind would walk that home. That's four in the air over square leg. I mean, I cannot believe this, guys. I cannot believe this. We were unbeaten going into this game. And now we're, we're going to be beaten. And it's not even going to be close. I mean, this is just 
what you call ridiculous. How did we go from that to to this? Uh, 50 for both openers. I mean, I cannot believe it. It's uh, what? Four more. Oh, four buys. I mean, oh my lord. What are we doing? Like, honestly. Data to Goud. Four more. I am an honest shot. Yadav to Goud. We need some wickets. Over square leg for four. Fifteen to win now. Data. We need a wicket. And it's dropped. You wouldn't believe it. After all the hard work of trying to get something... Oh my goodness me. How embarrassing. 10 to win. 10 to win. 151 without the loss of a wicket. Off the back foot. Through cover. Four more. Two to win. I am in honest disbelief that this is happening to us. I'm frankly quite shocked. Data with everyone up. There it is. The winning run. And Madhya Pradesh have absolutely stomped home. 80 not out off 106. Easily his best score of the season. Goud, 73 not out. And we lose by 10 wickets and it's not even close. Wow. We have been honestly put back to our place, really. I thought we were in a good place going to this game. Potentially to finish top two easily this season. Now I have a lot of doubt. Four for 30 for Katakia. Wins himself the player of the match. Dati, 4 for 57, his best performance of the season, and he was went wicketless before today, taking four wickets. I mean, I don't know if it's that's like meant to be, or if we're just absolute crap. I don't know, but that was poor as can be. Honestly, very shocked. Disappointed, ashamed, all of the above. Well, we are in fourth place, but I don't feel like we deserve to be in fourth place anymore. I'm in shock, to be honest, guys. I really am. I thought we were much better than that, and it turns out... I was wrong. I have no idea how to say that name. He is the top run scorer though. Let me know down in the comments how on earth I'm supposed to say that name. I do apologize because there is no way I'm going to get that one right. 339 runs from after four matches though. Ishan Kishan, 295. Karun Nair, 279. Saha, 269. Kohli, 263. Chandran, 15 wickets. And average of 13. Gopal, 12 wickets. Ahmed, 11. Pratap Singh, 10. Waria, 10. Vignesh and Kuna Sekera, 10 and 9. As we can see with the runs, Kartik, 123. Kumar, 110. Lamba, 101. Anderson, 94. Ramatula, 62. And the rest is history. Wickets, Aman, Data, and Quadri, all with four. In the next match, we will take on... We're going to take on Gurjarat Cricket Club in the next match, guys, at Ahmed Dabad. We can actually see the Indian squad for the next tour that they are going on we can see that Gil again has been selected is this a test tour or one day and t20 okay interesting Gil has been selected for both one day internationals and t20 internationals good to see from a Kolkata perspective not much else to speak of from that same perspective it does mean that all these players are now out of the domestic stuff and I believe as you can see up here, Boomer played for Gurjarat's cricket club. So we are now going to see Boomer out of action for the remainder, at least, or not really the remainder of the season, but at least for now. But guys, I do have to apologize for today. That was a really poor performance. In fact, I have to say that's one of my poorest performances I've had with the entire, within my entire one day career in this game. And I really questioned my decision to bat first because we got absolutely destroyed. But you know, you get that. We're going to have to move on very quickly. And hopefully we can beat Gurjarat Cricket Club in the next match, guys. But if you did enjoy this episode, subscribe for more content. Don't forget to leave a like. Follow me on my social medias down below. Join my Discord server. Hit the post notification bell, guys. And I will see you all in the next episode of our Road to Indian Glory, guys. With Bihar coming to you soon once again, guys. Until then, guys. Goodbye for now.